welcome to Hong Kong. <laughs> so we're gonna go up the mountain to Victoria Peak, which is probably, I think, a must do when you're in Hong Kong. So that's what we're going to do. <laughs> This is our bathroom. It's so, like, everything is so cute and tiny. <laughs> this is the room. <laughs> this is the room. We got two beds. But this view, oh my god. This makes up for, like, everything. Because <laughs> the beds are really, really hard. <laughs> and really not comfortable. But this view makes up for everything, so it's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Let's see how long it's gonna take this time before the elevator comes. <laughs> These elevators are horrible. They like keep passing you, so it's more. Th we were waiting and they like pass us like three times and in the end we're like, okay, let's just walk. So we walked down 23 floors. <laughs> so we pressed both buttons and the elevator to go up came first. So Faith decided that we were going to the rooftop first. This is our rooftop. Swimming pool's out of service. But this view is really pretty. prettiest like nature hikes next to a big city. I love hikes. Until the point that I'm really tired and I don't like them anymore. At this point I still love it. <laughs> Who photographed, who photographed, I can't talk, 
some buildings in Hong Kong and he made this picture so we wanted to find this hotel and we did but it doesn't look as big as on the picture in real life we're going to the night market <laughs> Because you can't go to Asia without going to a night market. <laughs> Good morning, guys. This is our last day in Hong Kong. I didn't film anything yesterday because we had a meeting with somebody who works in social housing here in Hong Kong. My mom arranged it. It was really interesting. We got to see some apartments. Um, that are used for co-living, so two families live in the apartment together. It was really small and kind of shocking, but it was really interesting. And then we did a little bit of shopping. Bought a new denim jacket, which I can't wear because it's way too hot, but <laughs> back home I'll be able to wear it. And today is our last day. Tonight we leave for the airport because we fly at 12.30 a.m. And now we're gonna do a little bit more exploring. I think we're gonna go to Causeway Bay because they have a Victoria's Secret store there. <laughs> and then we're gonna grab some lunch somewhere and just walk around. So that's the plan for today. <laughs> for this like I think it's two eight hour flights and then a three hour layover so it's gonna be fun because I love flying definitely don't but it's okay we could drop our baggage actually in the city so that's really nice because we could take the train with only our carry-on and now we don't have to check in anymore we don't have to drop our baggage so we can go straight through security which is where we're heading now it's time for our second flight <laughs> We already had a first one, which was about eight hours. I think this one is gonna be about seven. So that's better. And then hopefully we'll be in Amsterdam soon. 